Hello everyone, welcome to Jadam. In this episode, I'll talk about how to use and store the Jadam natural pesticide. Here I have prepared Jadam wetting agent, Jadam sulfur, and Jadam herbal solution. With this combination, you are getting the perfect natural pesticide for your garden and for farming. And in this video, I'll show you how to mix all the solution in a proper way. This is Jadam herbal solution, which is the extract of any herbs with insecticide repellent effect. The herbs that are often used are peppermint, rosemary, lavender, Jerusalem artichoke, and brocken. And recently we have been testing Cosmos plant and it is showing significant results. With all this plant, you can control from aphids to mite. But above all, our most favorite plant is ginkgo until now, because there is not a single pest that we won't be able to control with this plant. All the details and the ratio are listed in my book Jadam Organic Farming and the new book Jadam Organic Pest and Disease Control. Briefly speaking, it is very straightforward to make plant extracts. All you need is to boil the plant for 5 hours. And more detailed information is spoken in my lecture, so please click the link above to see the lecture video. The first thing I would like to talk about is how to store the herbal solution. Once you are done with the boiling the herbs, pour the solution in a bottle to put it in a sideways so that it can be vacuum sealed. In this way, you can store the herbal solution for a couple of years. But the problem is when you open it for use, because when it contacts with the air, the properties of the solution start to change gradually, which causes decrease in its insecticidal function. An easy way to identify that the solution is usable or not is the air pressure of the bottle due to the fermentation. But to make sure, the best way is to drop a small portion of Jadam wetting agent before any use in different beaker. Once you drop the JWA, if the color of the JHS doesn't change, that means it is still good for use. And another problem is how to store an opened bottle properly. Even if you put it into refrigerator, the changes cannot be stopped. So the best way is to get the help of ethanol. There are usually two types of ethanol sold in the market. One is with 84% purity and the other one is with 99% purity. When you are using 99% ethanol, add 15% of ethanol from what is left over and 84% with 25%. With the help of ethanol, you can increase the shelf life of Jadam herbal solution even in atmospheric temperature. When none of the herbs are available near you, you can also use sodium hydroxide as an alternative solution for pest control. With sodium hydroxide, you can treat a problem of scale insects and snails. However, I do not recommend constant use of this substance because of the concentration damage. JWA is recommended to use around 200 to 600 ml for 20 liters and 5 to 15 liters for 500 liters. JS is 40 ml to 60 ml for 20 liters and JHS is 200 ml to 600 ml for 20 liters. Recently, we have been receiving a lot of questions from florists and gardeners about our Jadam solution. So let me elaborate on how to combine all three solutions for pest and disease control. This, this is the sprayer that I use for testing the solution before the field test. This particular brand of spray is my favorite due to its long-lasting durability. It costs little more, but this is a product worth a check out. Since we are testing one liter of small amount, measuring the ratio also must be calculated with the syringe. Before doing the mixing process, please do use soft water. It is mandatory to achieve its full capability. And now, let me show you how the natural disinfectant is made. I'll, I'll measure 800 ml of soft water. First, I will add 10 ml of Jadam wetting agent. Next, 2 ml of Jadam sulfur. And now it is complete. This yellowish human urine-like liquid is natural disinfectant. It can treat downy mildew, 
powdery mildew, and anthracnose. Speaking of anthracnose, you can also control this just by increasing JWA. As you can see, Jadam's natural pet solutions are very easy to do with the best effect on pest and disease control. And by adding Jadam herbal solution, it becomes all-purpose natural pest and disease solution. Then I'll add a little more water to make it one full liter. Best thing about Jadam Natural Pesticide, unlike any commercially available chemical pesticide, Jadam Natural Pesticide is very safe to use. There will be no big problem even if it is contacted on our skin. So you can also just wash the fruit to eat right after spraying. Jadam Natural Pest Solution is all about combination of JWA, JS, and JHS. To increase insecticidal effect, all you need to do is to increase the amount of JWA and JHS, and for disinfectant, increase JS. But make sure to perform concentration test in advance for JS before spraying into the crops. In this way, you can control almost all pest and disease. You can add additional sodium hydroxide and red clay powder for scale insects and snails. Let me show you how to add them. Just add the sodium hydroxide in the beaker with water to melt it down. This is very useful for scale insects. An additional red clay powder is for increasing the penetration effect. First, add the water and stir a couple of times, then let it sit for a while until the layer is cleared out and collect the surface of the red clay powder to add it into the bottle. With this simple solution, you don't have to worry about pest and disease that occurs during farming, but make sure to use it all before three days. However, when you are adding sodium hydroxide, the solution can irritate your skin when it makes contact. So please be aware of that. I've also listed all the detailed videos on how to make all of this. It is also stated in my book so that you can read one for yourself. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.